and welcome to Weather Now with Tyler Aldinger. So some current conditions outside is 54 degrees. As you can see, it was foggy this morning, but the sun is starting to poke through, so that will increase the temperatures as well as the humidity, which is at 96%. Also, every day, sunset, 5.43 p.m. I mean, you come on, every day it gets longer, so we got another 30 minutes to add on until we turn the clocks back. That gives us more time to play outside. <clears throat> so now taking a look at the seven day forecast this morning it was foggy as you can see but the patchy fog is starting to clear up and we are going to get into some partly sunny conditions later today with the high being around 64 degrees and then tomorrow we have some a.m. sun which is going to continue from this afternoon into tomorrow and then we're going to have some p.m. rain with a high of 67. Looking towards the weekend not looking that great we have showers and rain pretty much consistently through the weekend, so not very good with the high in the 40s and mid 50s. Going into next week, the high of 53 as the sun will start to come back out then. So now here we're gonna look at this low pressure system here. As you can see, it's staying north of Pennsylvania mostly, but what we're gonna see is tomorrow, this low pressure system is going to come down into our area, which will make all that rain tomorrow. So as you can see on this map here, we have this low pressure system right here Staying above our area, as you can see, you know, this is keeping the cooler weather up north of us. But as we're going to see tomorrow, now this low pressure system is going to come down into our area. And that is going to bring some cooler temperatures and along with that, the rain. Also a potential for some freezing rain as well. As you can see here on this chart, this is going to represent the temperature. As you can see, it increases, increases, and it's going to stay in about the mid 50s throughout or 40s throughout the night and then tomorrow it's going to increase back up into the 60s spike up there before as you can see it's going to go down later tomorrow evening so we get more of that average weather for this time of year and now breaking records february 20th 60 degrees in 1930 and our high expectancy for today is 60 degrees so hopefully we can break some records and also tomorrow february 21st 65 degrees in 1953 so we'll see it doesn't get any better than this for this time of year people get out and enjoy that weather as much as you can because it's not going to be here for very long and spring is still a little bit of ways away